Thank you. Uh, uh, I uh, have to be uh, grateful to to share the experience of Mexico in in, in this uh, area. Uh, I will be talking about the this is the information technology available at, uh, through the national statistical and information is. Uh, ministry, ministry that uh, somebody talked uh, uh, about earlier. Uh, these, these are the legal framework to the National Statistic and Geographic Information through the NGIS system. Uh, it has a national data infrastructure, geodetic reference, aerial photography, the test on the relief, and data, geographic names. Uh, and uh, there is a server ca called Gaia in which uh, you can access uh, maps and, and bio biodiversity and, and other variables. Uh, uh, I want to, to take your attention in this. Uh, uh, this will be a forum that will be held in 24 and 25 in Mexico City. And there are several topics uh, there, geology, sensors, and uh, many, many things. Uh, also, we have a, some advanced through the Marine Ministry in Mexico. We cover oceanography, meteorology, uh, 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 biodiversity, and uh, national commissions uh, integrated by, by several uh, uh, ministries in, in, in Mexico. And well, uh, there is uh, uh, some maps and information about the, uh, this in these regions, uh, pertaining uh, the, the the collaboration with CMI, uh, I think this is this will be the the, the in, in which uh, we can uh, collaborate. There are uh, well um, synoptic charts, uh, the the regions, uh, uh, meteorological stations, and uh, also we have a uh, sea level uh, records in those stations uh, and some uh, oceanographic variables. There is also biodiversity through the CONAVIO, the National Commission for Knowledge of, the, of Biodiversity. Uh, this ministry, uh, this commission has two reception antennas that covers almost the, the, the whole uh, Republic of Mexico. This is, uh, there are also several uh, topics, there are uh, uh, marine monitoring, uh, a satellite system for uh, oceanic monitoring, uh, also uh, uh, reef systems, uh, and there are, there, uh, they also have a, a map survey in which there is a lot of, of, of maps. That is a, an example of, uh, I think, chlorophyll este, in several years. <coughs> Uh, the, the, the relevant products, uh, uh, the National Oceanographic Data Center, Mexico, could uh, act as a, as a bridge to these uh, ministries to get uh, data and, and information uh, relevant for CMA2. Uh, we can also uh, generate products from uh, uh, world data sources, like, like this one. This is, for example, uh, significant hay some modeling for hypon and uh, water masses, temperature, uh, etc. And uh, uh, in Mexico also uh, collaborates to increase capacity building. We can go to, to uh, uh, other countries in, in Latin America to, to share what we learned in, in our courses in Austin. Uh, and from two 2000 to uh, 2015, we have talked about say, 12 courses in, in Mexico City, in, 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 in the, the state of Mexico. Uh, well, the main linkage uh, should be uh, through the through National Oceanographic Data Center, we can make a bridge to, to the ministries uh, that I showed already. Uh, uh, on data information sharing, well, uh, there is a, a, an effort of Mexico called uh, Mexico OS, which is the Mexico Coastal Ocean Observing System, which is a, a collaboration with 
French and, and, and Germany uh, to establish a, a monitoring system in, in the Gulf of Mexico. There are also some bilateral uh, collaboration with the U.S. through the Gulf of Mexico Large Marine Ecosystem, which could be linked with the with the Caribbean uh, marine uh, that Caribbean Large Marine Ecosystem. Also, we have hydrographic surveys through uh, through Ecosur, like like this one. Those data could be well. I need to ask uh, permission to Dr. Acarrillo to 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 share those data with CM2. Uh, and this is a, a, a kind of, of result that, that we have. And finally, oh well, there is another effort, which is CIMARGOM, which is a consortium of universities which are uh, working with the U.S., with uh, our counterparts in the U.S., which are about uh, 60 universities and, and, and research centers in the U.S., in the, in the uh, side of Mexico are about uh, 20 universities and, and uh, centers of research, which we will work in together to, to, to get some uh, knowledge about the Gulf of Mexico. And, and, and well, uh, the linkage could be planning activities. We have uh, expertise in uh, deploying uh, voice sensors and then to manage that, that kind of data. There is also an effort. Uh, I come from the Pacific side. This is the San Diego in scripts as Southern California Coastal Ocean Observing System. We are uh, working with them with our radar, uh, high frequency radar, and this uh, uh, observatory is linked with the Mexican part. That's that's all. Thank you, Matt Carlos. Um, any questions?